Good morning. Happy Monday. Mama, mama. What? What? Every time. Every time. I know. I see it. So we are. <laughs> it is almost ten o'clock. We were trying to get to Chick Fil A. We should be good, but sometimes the lines are a little cray. We're trying to get to Chick Fil A before breakfast. We. We're gonna do a lunch picnic at the park today, what we'll the playground, but she's already bored. It's day one of spring break, almost 10 o'clock, and she's bored. So. <laughs> so, our lunch plans quickly turn to breakfast plans. I'm literally shocked right now. I don't think I've ever seen our Chick fil A like this, especially since it's spring break. Mommy, are we going inside? No, we're not going inside. Thank you, YouTube. Ready to go to the park, the playground, yeah! whatever. <laughs> okay. Like the playground is the same. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys. So we are home. Yay! We are home from playground we're having some like struggles I guess we'll say with Brooklyn and her patience level so so um we're really struggling because um she she's a busybody okay she always has to be doing something she can very rarely ever sit still and so we walked in from being at the park and immediately they're fighting in there immediately she has to be doing something else and i told her i said brooklyn i'm about to sit down and eat lunch and the whole entire time that I was eating lunch, she's just like, are you done yet? Are you done yet? Are you done yet? Are you done yet? I want to die eggs. I want to die eggs. I'm like, Brooklyn, we have a whole week of spring break. Can we spread the love a little bit? Like, we'll do something fun every day, I promise. But we can't do it all in one day. So, I thought I would share kind of where we are at with Addison's room. I shared this room with you. That's better. It was a hot mess. It was like our guest room slash storage slash like tubs of stuff. It was just kind of okay, let's mess. do a shot thing. Where so we've recently got the going? bed out of here. Yeah. And yeah. it's pretty much already done. Um, I like, and I was kind of like this with both of my girls. I like to get stuff done okay. early and fast while I feel good because I know my body and I know like... In a few weeks, I'm just not gonna feel like doing anything. And so, I will show you kind of what we got going on. Don't mind all the feminine products that my sweet girl has thrown all over the floor, but we have the crib. This is the same crib Brooklyn used and Kenzie used. So, praise the Lord, we haven't had to buy another crib. Now the problem we have is keeping them out of it. Especially Kenzie. She doesn't understand. She can't climb in, climb out. Brooklyn, don't do it. Could you get I will get them. Yes, I will get them. You stay out. So. Up there. Okay. So we have the crib here. The only other thing that I'm going to add is I have a big giraffe print. Kind of like a watercolor giraffe print that... I'm gonna grab from Hobby Lobby. And then I don't, I may end up getting a chair. I don't know yet. It's kind of, I don't know. It's kind of low on my priority list right now. Um, I can talk more about that in another video, but I may get a small chair, whether it's just a rocking chair or kind of like one of those mid-century rocking chairs from Amazon. And get it right there this is a very small room so i don't have much space for like nor do i really want to pay for a big comfy glider so we got in these really pretty curtains i'm trying not to show my neighbor who's <laughs> getting out of their car um i'll wait till i'll wait till they move 
This is actually like the um, mattress topper from our bed that we moved out of here. I gotta find somewhere to put that. And then we've got the dresser in here. This is the same Wait, dresser that I used with Kinsey and Brooklyn. Literally same kind of nursery deal okay. that I did with the girls. Just Rock, different paper. decor Rock, stuff. Paper, we're gonna, we're gonna do so, I don't know if you can see these we're curtains very well because obviously, let me see if Bob I can fix it. Obviously, because we don't have blinds, Wait, but they're blackout curtains. It's just a really pretty, dusty, mauvey pink color. And so, that's right, literally right. going to be the only color in no. this room. And I kind of like it that way. Oh, no. oh my gosh. So, let's go. They Woo! are throwing pump bottles into my new diaper bag, which I will share. I'm obsessed with. Go, I'll share that go, um, in another video, but it's an Amazon find. And like Ready? I said, I'm obsessed. You got this. So I got this $10, I think it was $9.99, $10 lamp from Here. Target. Same little um, changing pad I had with the girls. Over here, I just have some stuff that I've laid out. And then right here, I'm gonna put some kind of a shelf. Um, I, let's see, I'll show you what I have. And this is gonna be kind of funny. Let me turn you around. This is kind of how my brain works. I'll get it. I'll which, get it. I don't know, I guess I'll it's a good it thing at some, in some cases wait, when I'm trying to wait. save money. Yeah, so um, I have slats, old wooden slats, from a twin bed that we are not using. And they look like this. Hold on, let's see if I can hold it up. So they look like this, which I'm thinking I'm gonna convert into shelves. I have three of them. So I'm thinking I may do three of them Stop. on that wall that Stop. I just showed you. Here, turn around on this wall right here. Go ahead. I have three, I may only use two. Right there, try um, there. No so I think it would look super cute. Now that way we won't have to buy Grab shelves. Death. I may end up having to buy like the shelf, okay. what are they called, brackets? I don't know. But then again, I have these. Go ahead. So I could always like spray paint the Ready? shelves white. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. Yeah, I have to We're all about kind to. of repurposing, so saving money in this house. house. Um, yeah, and so okay, you're I think the only other thing left that I would have to do is put like some sort of laundry basket in this corner maybe a fake plant that would be cute but my husband is anti-fake plants because they collect dust right Wait, <laughs> so that's really it i want to get a mirror to put there and honestly my okay, sort of nursery that. game has always just been light bright minimalistic simple and it helps too that this um, room is so tiny. So that's it. That is really it. I I don't have a lot of things that I need to buy. Thankfully, um, when I was pregnant with Brooklyn, I kind of made a pact to myself that I would just buy a bunch of gender neutral things and not so much pink. That way it could just last me forever. And it has proven to be, well, I guess I could have bought all pink because three girls later, we're still buying pink stuff. Um, but I, the only thing I need is I need a little, like a stroller cage. I'm just gonna get, like, well, cage, <laughs> the frame um, for the car seat. I'm just gonna get a frame and then later on purchase a stroller. But I need that. I need <clears throat> something for baby to sleep in now since, I'm not gonna go like on a tangent. Um, I'm, I reshared a post on Facebook about the rock and play ordeal. My babies, that thing literally, no pun intended, um, cause it's seriously so sad what other families have gone through when it comes to that, but literally saved my kids, like saved our sanity. I will say, say I will say it saved our sanity because that is the only thing my kids would sleep in is that rock and play. Brooklyn had pretty bad um, acid reflux. She puked after every feeding. And so she had to sleep in something that was not flat. 
and she wouldn't sleep in anything flat. She actually slept in a swing for probably the first four months and then Kenzie slept in that rock and play for about the first four months. So, I mean, once they could roll over, roll out, they were in their crib, but so I'm just going to be cautious and get something like a bassinet or something. I have a Moses basket, but I would prefer to have a bassinet that I could travel with so that I could take it to my mom's house or say we go on vacation. I can take it with me. You can't really like transport a Moses basket. So I need something for baby to sleep in and I need just a stroller frame. Other than that, she's pretty good to go. Um, we've just kind of passed everything else down. So that is nursery update, baby update, Brooklyn's patience update. Okay, so we're back. It is like 3.30 and we're gonna die Easter eggs. <laughs> Because y'all know Brooklyn has well I don't like Brooklyn is just about killed me today. Um, I don't like just it. about killed me. I don't like me. So I got a two dollar egg dyeing kit from Five Below. This is what it looks like. Careful. Do you do purple what little girls don't like unicorns. Hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I'm doing it like Okay, so we finished dyeing the eggs. We're waiting for them to dry before they can put stickers on them. This one woke up from her nap a little grumpy, right? Are we being grumpy? Okay. Yes, I can help you. So, I think we're gonna end the vlog here. Batteries died anyways. I've got dinner on the stove. We're gonna eat in a little bit and then probably do baths and call it a day. So, thank you guys, hold on. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you're new, make sure you subscribe. Hit that like button, and we will see you next time. Bye.